Hello, my beautiful friends, it's Marie here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So many of you asked in the comments that I make a video about feet strengthening and I wanted to make one for a pretty long time, but today we're finally doing it and I decided that I want to get together all of my favorite exercises and make it into a 10 minute easy going fun little routine that you can do at any time of the day that is not going to be very difficult, but it's just going to be fun and we can just exercise together, just the same format as the fitness uh, routines, as the fitness workouts, but make it ballet and do the ballet exercises in the same follow along thing. So let me know what you think about these types of videos, but without the further ado, let's get into the exercises that we are going to be doing today. So I need some explanations to do while we're going to be going through the exercises. So we are starting with releve on both feet in the sixth position and we're doing just this motion, just feet in the sixth position, just simple releve. Then the second exercise is going to be half releve in the first position, first-ish position. But this is actually the exercise that our teacher at Vaganova Academy, Ludmila Kovalova, taught us. And it is one of my favorites. So you are going to be standing in the first position and you are going to be doing half releves just in the middle, just starting, not on the floor, never putting the heels on the floor and never releving to the fullest. So just in the middle doing these little pulsing motions. Then we're doing a weird one, but a very effective one. We're doing these grabbing motions. So just like the monkeys that used to grab things that still grab things with hands and uh, feet, but we need to articulate our feet on stage and it is very important. It is a very important aspect of a ballerina's dancing. So we are going to be using our elastic band here. So, but you can really just use anything, just a towel or just a piece of cloth. So just grabbing it and then engaging the arch and then releasing, grabbing with the toes then engaging the arch and then releasing. So something like this. Then we're going to come seated, of course, repeating this, the previous exercise from the right leg and then the left leg. Then we're going to come seated and we are going to do this, you know, this elastic band position. So over the toes and then under the heel, one and under the heel, two. So just like this, and from this position, hopefully it makes sense, we're going to do the foot stretch. So up and down and up and down. So we are repeating this exercise from the right foot and then the left foot as well. And then we are going into a simple releve on the right foot and then on the left foot. Nothing fancy, just simple releve holding onto the bar. And then we're going to be facing the bar and doing a move from ballet class. We are going to really articulate our feet doing tendus and le pied. So these are all of the exercises and let's just try doing them together for 10 minutes. 50 seconds on and 10 seconds break in between. So let's get my timer started here. And in 10 seconds, just simple releve sixth position. So five, four, three, two, one, and let's begin. Up and down. Nice controlled movement. So obviously you can hold on to something while doing this, but I always find that it's quite useful to do just on your own, just trying to balance, engaging all of the muscles in your body. So try to really control, not to fall down, but really control the heels going down. Okay, very nice, 10 seconds break. Now going to a half releve in the first position. So turn out a little bit, go up a little bit and just little tiny pulses. 
So obviously all of these exercises you can do for, if you don't like the format of this routine, you can do for more time or less time, however you prefer. So you can just, you know, split the routine and choose your favorite exercises and just keep doing only them. Or adding something else, some of your favorite exercises for your feet. So keep pulsing, also engage your turnout muscles here. And we are done. Now let's get our elastic band and let's do the grabbing. So three to one, get ready with your right foot. So grab, arch, release, grab, stretch, release and release. So this feels weird, but it's actually very effective, especially when you really squeeze your food muscles. So this exercise especially, you can really just, you know, keep doing for forever, for eternity, like while watching TV shows or Netflix or while studying, while reading, just, you know, keep doing it and your feet are going to be so strong. This is one of my absolute favorites. And we are done now, starting with the left foot. And let's begin. So grab, lift and engage the arch. And then you know this exercise is also training the brain patterns so that when you are doing the ballet class afterwards, you will remember how to really point your toes and really show your arch. So my elastic band is doing something a little bit weird. It's looking like a chewing gum now, but it's okay. We can still keep grabbing it. Oops, <laughs> didn't work. It's okay. And we are done. Now come seated and quickly, quickly, quickly do this pattern with your elastic band under and under and let's begin for the foot stretch so it is very important to keep your foot straight not going to any like directions and really flex and stretch really straight and resist the elastic band It is also much better to do these exercises slower so that every tiny little muscle in your feet works. So almost done with this interval. And done. So 10 seconds to change the elastic band situation, the elastic band position. So under your heel and under. Create some tension here and let's quickly start. So just like this. So again, you can continue doing this exercise for more than one minute, but don't go too crazy because in my life there was one period when I did too many of these and then my feet really hurt for some time. It was tough and difficult to be honest, but you know, just know a good measure to everything. So we're done with this interval. So get rid of the elastic band. We are going into releve on one foot. So I'm going to hold onto the bar for this one. So just releve and down.
Control every movement with your muscles. It is very important here. You know, the releve should be soft. You should not be doing this. It should be soft, nice and soft. So really like adagio for releve, if you know what I mean. You know, Marianella Nunez style of dancing. So that's what you should be imagining while doing releves. You know, really, really soft and controlled. And I love her dancing so, so, so much. I'm such a fan. Okay, 10 seconds break. And go on to the left foot. And start it up. Okay, really nice guys, keep going, keep controlling. And we are done, and for the last two exercises, let's face the bar and do again like the first ish position and we're going to do it kanji really feeling the floor and then pour the pie resisting the floor and then stretching and closing you know really really articulating your foot here and close putting a lot of tension in your foot muscles and really feeling the floor kanji slow pour le pied Pushing into the floor and close. Showing your best arch. Okay, really nice, guys. Sometimes it's really, really useful to do some tundus without the belly shoes on, just with the bare feet. It really works again for the brain patterns. So, done with the right leg interval here and now the left, three, two, one, and go. Engage the muscles. Work with your brain here. Okay, really nice. We're almost done. This is a pretty fast routine, but I'm loving it. And it's a little bit of everything. Squeeze them, little muscles. 10 seconds left. Give me the best you've got. And the last one, last little pour le pied, and we are done. Okay, so this is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for joining. Thank you so much for doing these exercises with me. Let me know what your opinion is about this little routine. Let me know what other videos you want to see on my channel. Subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already to see more ballet-related content. I would really love to see you in our little family of ballet-interested people, people interested in ballet. And I really love you guys and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and wishing you all the very best and I will see you in my next videos. Bye guys! <laughs>